How's it going everyone? Welcome back and today I'll talk about how to solve unable to download update error on your iPhone when it comes to update iOS 26 beta or the main update. Now this mainly happens for a few different reasons. It can happen for network glitch, slow stories, poor internet connections or beta profile issue. To solve that problem, the first thing that you gotta really really do, I would say just go first work on your internet. So what you can do, you can just go open up your software browser and type this fast com so if you just type fast.com this website will literally tell you the current internet speed of your device if it's poor you can go and open up your control panel and enable airplane mode for about like 10 to 20 seconds and you can disable that and after that check whether just that help you out to boost your internet or not now right after that i would say just go and check out your storage sometimes if your storage are running out then you're never going to be able to update the latest software so in that case go and open up our settings and just simply tap general go to your iphone storage and find out your storage now if your stories are almost full make, make sure you have at least 15 gigabyte of free storage so iOS 26 is actually huge so make sure you are you know like having more storage that's that that is necessary so um just make sure to delete some unused apps or games since you don't want to use it anymore on your iphone after clearing out your storage from here a little i would say um next take a look at your battery charging percentage so you whether you know it or not like if you have less than 50 percent of the charge of your iphone then you are not going to be able to update your iphone so put your iphone to charge and charge it over 50 percent and then restart the process and see whether it works or not after following that i would say just go ahead and restart your iphone and start over the process so after restarting your iphone go on up and up your settings then go to your general the software update and then check whether your problem is solved or not i can tell you guys after following all of that your problem is definitely going to resolve but still after following all the process if you still have problems please do let me know in the comment section see you all around